So hey, uh, I'm one of the developers for Project Scarlet, the new Xbox that's coming out, and this is actually one of the prototypes that we're working on. Uh, you might think that it's an Xbox 360, but that's simply because Microsoft has a habit of uh, using old Xbox cases for prototype hardware. That's to prevent leaks or anything uh, of that nature. Um, I've been given permission today to show you what's on the inside. Um, but we can start by plugging it in and see what happens. As you might notice, it's a familiar globe, a different color than usual. Uh, nothing unusual. Uh, this is just letting us know that it's booting and it's now booted. So now, of course. So this, so this is just to test the uh, RGB lights that are going to be in the next Xbox. We're not actually going to have them cycling like this. I mean, of course you can, but when it's in the new case, uh, it's going to look fantastic. So now we're going to get to the meat of it. And the reason why we think that this Xbox 360 is going to put every other console to shame, and more importantly, it's going to be it's it's going to put PC gaming to death, at least for the next 10 years. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look. So if we go ahead and look inside, sorry, this might take a little bit of time. But if we take a look inside and whoa, still going with the old uh, onions and potatoes, but more importantly, this time around, we actually have a legitimate processor uh, powered by an Arduino, but it's a real processor. We hadn't seen that before in the past. Um, and graphics are going to be good. RGB all the way. It's a lot of power, isn't it? So, quite a lot to expect. Uh, not really sure how the PC gaming industry is going to compete with this. Uh, you know, we, we, we saw... You know, we saw one potato with the Xbox One, we saw two with the 360, three with the Xbox One X. Man, four potatoes, two onions, and an actual processor! Jeez, what are they going to think of next? Well, mark my words. PC gaming... It's dead. It's dead.